Yeah, hey guys, so in this video, I'll try to show you something fast in Blender 4.3. They remove uh, a bloom effect we was uh, used in Eevee. So a simple way to get it back is uh, we can go back here to active ray tracing. So maybe when I enable, I get some shades or bloom. But if you need uh, the real bloom, you need to go here, uh, composition, and then use nodes. And here we have a couple of nodes we can add. So it's pretty simple. So the first one, I'm gonna go here, shift A and go to reroute to add this point. So I can split this uh, shader. And then I'm gonna hit uh, F3 and search for the viewer. It's pretty simple. And this node something to view what I have actually rendered or what my image. So I'm gonna hit render now. And just have it something like this and close. And when I'm done, I'm gonna see the background here. So next we need the bloom effect. So we're gonna go to F3 and search for the glare. This one, and I'm gonna set it in the middle. And we're gonna see now we have uh, some effects we can use. So we have bloom or fog bloom. We have two kinds. So for this one, I'm gonna make it the quality is high. And straight shot maybe. Something like this. So this one is the bloom. And you can go here for another one. And now try to fog glue and make it high. And also you can tweak this, this stuff here. And when you be satisfied, like one here, like image editor. This one, go to viewer node. So now you have this one, it's gonna be your render. So when I play around here, like this or this, you're gonna see your final render. So I'm gonna active ray tracing here. And when you're done, you can save it from here or just go here and your image, image and go save as. So I hope that was useful. So the bloom is just this one, the glare, and you can use bloom or the fog glue. So as you want, it's back to you. And here we're done. So have fun and I'll catch you later. Bye.